Hey everybody, this is Paul Colligan. Welcome to Apps and Tools Thursday. Um, in this episode, it's going to be slightly different because it's really neither an app nor a tool. Um, it's more of a hack. Maybe we should call it Apps, Tools, and Hacks Thursday or something like that. But anyway, I digress. Oh, it's also about Facebook, so maybe it belongs on Friday, but I'm sure we've got something great coming to you tomorrow. Um, subscribe to eMarketing Vids. It's a good idea. It keeps you up to date with all the things we're doing across all of the channels. Anyway, let's chat about Facebook. Facebook just added something extremely cool. And if you haven't heard about it, go ahead and do some research on this. But basically now you can log on to Facebook pages as the actual page itself. So here I am on my public page. This is the page that I give out to the world where I show what I'm doing in business and that kind of stuff. As opposed to the personal page, pictures of my kids, that kind of stuff. So um, if we go here, you'll see I'm logged in as myself. So we're going to hit a quick refresh of the page. And you can see because I'm logged in as the Paul Colligan public figure, if you will, um, I can do things like I can find notifications for the page. See how cool this is? I can find out people who have made updates, comments, likes, and whatnot on my page, and then I can quickly go through and like, I mean, anybody who comments, I wanna make sure that these things are good. So, you know, Alex made a comment, Christina made a post, uh, James made a comment. I mean, this is incredibly, incredibly important stuff. So, um, this is fabulous, this is great. And what's, what's even cooler is, is I can log on, you know, I can go to other Facebook pages, like for instance, let's go to the Traffic Geyser page, and um, as the Traffic Geyser page, here I am as Paul. But the great thing is, is I now have the ability to actually log on as Traffic Geyser. And so I can go through and I can make updates and whatnot as the Traffic Geyser persona, uh, see the new people that have added on, that type of thing, all there, all very good. Now, if you are like me, um, you're going to find yourself in a situation where, you know, you're now back at the Paul Colligan page and, you know, you click everyone and you start to make a comment, you know, maybe, oh, why haven't I liked this? And then you make a comment and, hey, um, it's a great day, you know, and then you realize that, oh my goodness, you know, I posted as traffic guys or not as Paul, ah, oops, sorry, remove the post you know, go back and then use, you know, Facebook as Paul Colligan. Um, this is where things can get confusing and, and uh, whatnot. So here's the hack, or um, here's the trick, if you will. You'll notice here that I'm using a copy of Firefox. And what I do is on my computer, most of us have multiple browsers. Most of us have, you know, either Internet Explorer, if we have a PC, or we have Safari, if we have a Mac. Those are always on there by default. Most of us have Firefox. A good chunk of us have Chrome. And so what I've done is I've logged on to each of the systems as a different page, the, the pages that I monitor the most. So when I log on to Facebook through Firefox, I'm logged on as, as Public Paul, if you will. When I've logged on as Chrome, you can see I've logged on as the eMarketing's vids page, and I can see you know all the people that joined us with eMarketing vids and whatnot start making changes and updates accordingly. And then, you know, even better, or I don't know if this is necessarily even better, but then when I log on with um, Safari, then I can see myself here in the social media marketing machines area and see what's happening there. Um, it's a really, really good idea to log on on a regular basis as the different fan pages. And, you know, if you're running just a couple of pages, um, assign each log on, if you will, to a different browser. Then you can just go to Facebook and act as that particular person. Hope that makes sense. If you've got any questions, go ahead and leave a comment. We'll do what we can to answer them. And we will, you know, later fully explore all the changes that have been made to Facebook over the coming weeks. Definitely subscribe to eMarketing Vids because we got a lot coming. Talk to you guys soon. Bye.